The world is full of hate right now. The world, the, just the energy, things. I'm going to show you a lot of things right now. I, I got a list, right? I'm going to vent. I'm going to vent. But listen, the music video drops in 45 minutes, so I'm going to make this quick. I got a list right here, right? I'm going to go down the list. I'm going to show you how this rap game, right? I'm going to show you how this rap game is full of liars, right? I'm going to show you how this rap game is full of rats, right? I'm going to show you how this rap game really works, right? I'm the hottest artist right now. I'm telling you that for a fact. People don't want to hear it. People are going to be like, no, but what about this person? No, wait, what about, what about this person? What about this person? But they never gonna, they never gonna admit the facts, right? I'm gonna prove, I'm gonna prove to you something right now. Watch. So the rap game right now will try to do something that's called blackballed, right? Where they blackball somebody is where they don't want you to win, but they don't give you no radio. They don't do certain shit, but you can't stop this. When you get 700, right? This is normal live, right? 700, 800,000 people tuning into your live. They don't know how to stop it. Like, listen, he, when, when you come home and cooperate with the government and you rap, right? You automatically not supposed to have a career. They don't want you to know that, right? They don't want you to know that. Y'all can hear me? All right, so look. The rap game, I want, I want y'all to hear this. The rap game don't want y'all to know certain stuff, right? And I'm going to expose the whole rap game right now because I, I got facts, right? This is what I do. When I come on live and... Shout out to the Queen Nikki. She'll be joining in, in just a few. The rap game is full of rats, right? They don't want you to know this, but with the 800 people watching, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show y'all what it is. Everybody picks and choose who they want to pick. They want to pick sides with and who because you know what everybody needs acceptance everybody needs to be like yo um pick it twice all right so desiree perez right desiree perez desiree perez and 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 people don't want to hear this but look I'm, I'm gonna show you this Listen, I don't got no animosity to, to Desiree, but people just want to pick and choose when they want to pick and choose, right? Meek Mill, you're first, right? You're going to be first. All right, so Desiree Perez, right? She's an executive at Rock Nation. She's an executive at Rock Nation. Desiree Perez was arrested, right? Desiree Perez... Is a Rock Nation executive that works with Meek Mill. She work, matter of fact, let me show you. She works with Meek Mill. She's right here. Look. What is that? Meek Mill's please guilty to old gun charges. Serve. Right? So people pick and choose who they, who's this? This is Desiree Perez. This is Meek Mill. This is Desiree Perez. This is Meek Mill. This is Desiree Perez. This is Meek Mill. Meek Mill. Desiree Perez. Let's let's find out who's Desiree Perez. So he, you see her right here with Jay Z. You see her with Meek Mill. You know what I'm saying? She's she she's an executive at Rock Nation. There she goes right here, right? Let's see who Desiree Perez is, right? Got you right now. Give me one right here. Look, Desiree Perez. So let's go to the Daily News, right? Let's go to the New York Daily News. Okay, let's go to the Daily News. The story that spooked Dash revealed how Perez, the wife of longtime Jay-Z 
wingman Juan Perez became a cooperating witness for the DEA in the 1990s. Again, this is this is public information. This is public information. Desiree Perez became a cooperating witness for the DEA in the 1990s after her 1994 arrest for possession of 35 kilos of cocaine. Perez stuck, struck a deal with the feds agreeing to wear a hidden wire to record her meetings with major cocaine traffickers, the cartel. Her undercover informant work won her courtroom praise for federal prosecutors, as does mine, after she helped them break up major drug dealers in Puerto Rico and Colombia. So I don't live, right? The live is being paused. You see Meek Mill right here with Desiree Perez, right? She's part of his bail with Jay Z. This part of Rock Nation, right? She's 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 a, she's a she's a executive at Rock Nation. But then you go saying, "Yo, listen, we don't fuck with rats." Your executive is a rat, so you pick and choose. Because if you don't want to be around rats completely, you're with a rat right there. She cooperated for the DEA. Meek Mill, you can't pick, pick and choose who you want to call rats. You can't say this is fake. This is on public information. This was on the New York, on the, on the New York Times. What are you going to say? No, I didn't know. I, I, you know. Sir, you know, you just can't chart. Ever since Nikki left you, you are a nobody. Listen, Nikki took you on tour. You were her opener. Nikki made you you, nigga. No bitch wanted to fuck you, nigga. Did you, did you forget who you was? Listen, I forgot what Drake said. What did Drake say? He said, is that... Some shit like, is that your tour or your girl's tour? That was never your tour, homie. Listen, you was put on by Nicki Minaj. And you rolling with rats now. But you know what? Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Nobody is gonna, nobody is gonna be like, yo, nobody's gonna expose this. You're with a rat every day. You're with a rat every day. You're with a rat. Your prison reform, your bail reform is with a rat. Oh, no, she wasn't street. She was selling kilos of cocaine. You don't want nobody to know? It's right here. Let me show you. Desiree Perez and Meek Mill. Desiree and Perez and Meek Mill walking out the courtroom. Desiree Perez and Jay-Z, right? Desiree Perea, Des Perez struck a deal with the feds, agreeing to wear a hidden wire to record her meetings with the major cocaine traffickers. Her undercover informant work won her courtroom praise for federal prosecutors. So who wants who? We pick and choose who we call. We pick and choose who we want to um, call rats. There's so many rats in this rap game. I got a list. I'm gonna go down the list. This whole lot. I'm gonna go down the whole, the whole list. Right. Listen, you can't pick and choose who you call rats. Meek, you're a fucking rat. Now, let's go back. Now, who's next on the list? Listen, future, you don't take care of your kids, right? You can't compare me to you because I can't have no communication with my... My baby mom was having sexual relations with my co-defendants. I'm going to stay away till I'm off house arrest, right? Something you don't know about. You rap about all his drugs. Never got arrested for drug offense. It's facts. L hear what I just said. You rap about Molly, Perks, and all this shit. Never got locked up for no drug offense. Again, I'm going to say it again. You rap about Percocets, Molly, all type of shit. You never got arrested for no drug offense. Again, you rap about Percocets, Molly, a whole bunch of other shit. You never got arrested for no drug offense. Ever. Ever. You go and say, yo, um, if you hang out with a rat, it makes you a rat. Right? You just posted that. So what does that make you? Because you hang around Meek. You hang around these niggas. What does that make you? 
Is there levels to this snitching? Oh, that's snitching level three. Oh, that's snitching level six. No, Takashi snitch on level 10, but t- s- level snitching six could do. Huh? Help it make sense to me, right? Help it make sense. We all know your homie. Listen, I'm half your age. You are old head to me. Listen, I'm half your age. If you mad because I could chart. Listen, I don't need Drake so I could have a platinum single. I don't need Drake. You and Meek Mill need Drake for every song y'all do so y'all could chart. Don't act like Meek didn't have to... Suck Drake's dick, balls, and dick all in his mouth just so he could have a career again. Because after Drake released back to back, you went under. You 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 became a you became Martin Luther King. Let's talk facts. Let's talk facts. Everybody apologizes to Drake. Everybody apologizes to Drake if they want to have a career again. You sir needed Drake. Nobody knows this because everybody is, um, nobody's really a label head like that. Nobody's a label head. The only reason your album did good is because Drake hop on Life is Good and keep it a stack. I know the numbers. I'm never going to shy away from the truth. Listen, if I fell off, I say I fell off. I'm the most hottest rapper. You can't go on live right now and get 800K. You can't. Nigga, you fucking with the big leagues now, homie. Everybody want to talk rap, 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 rap. Why can't you outdo the rap? Everybody want to say rap, rap, rap. Outdo the rap. Because I did this without features. What I'm doing with Nikki right now, and that's because I love her and I got mad respect for her. I did it on my own. You know this? Before I became a rap, I did it on my own. Think about that. Think about it. So if you chilling with a rat, right? Makes you a rat. You, sir, future, meek, you're a fucking rat. Let me play this back for you real quick. Boom. 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 Perez struck a deal with the feds agreeing to wear hidden wires. To record her meetings with major cocaine traffickers. Her undercover informant work won her the courtroom praise for the federal prosecutors. Listen, y'all don't want to hear it. Y'all don't want people to expose this. Y'all like, damn, nobody's going to expose this. Because you know what? If we all go against 6 9 if we all go against 6 9 if we all go against them right now, if we all go against them, nobody will ever air out our truth. Nobody. And that's facts. You don't think nobody will ever talk about it. Let me see who's next on the list. Listen, for for Snoop Dogg, I'm on you now, right? For Snoop Dogg, you want to talk all this rat shit. I exposed you already. You you hit me up in the DM talking about throwing the white flag, please, please, just something. Uh, this uh, you talk some straight old hat shit, straight old hat shit. Listen. Hear me out when I say this. You can't get mad at me. You can't get mad at me for exposing the truth, right? Because for the two years that I was locked up, for the two years that I was locked up, you know what y'all said? Y'all aired me out the whole time. For the two years, y'all, 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 y'all had me, y'all aired me out. Aired me out, aired me out. I'm just replying. Tell me if I'm right or wrong. Wasn't Snoop Dogg and Meek Mill couldn't get my dick out their mouth the whole time I was locked up? Rap, 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 rap. But now I'm on you. What happened? You want me to chill? Nah. Now I'm dragging it. Now I'm doing too much. Because I'm replying. Y'all aired me out. Aired me out. Aired me out. Aired me out. Now I reply. Now it's a problem. Huh? Let me know if it's a problem. Y'all don't like to hear the truth. Snoop Dogg, let's get to you. Let's get to you real quick, big homie. Right? Snoop Dogg's paperwork. Let Let me go on Google for this. Let me let me let me show y'all Meek Mill one last time with a rat, just just so y'all can see him right here. Look, I'm gonna show y'all one time before I switch to Snoop Dogg. Y'all want to talk about rats? Let's 
Eddie, Eddie's niggas out. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Because they got a lot to say, but till it's time. Snoop Dogg's paperwork right here. Let me see where this shit is at. Let me see, let me see, let me see. I don't even got eyes like that. Three men weapons discovered that both were. Deputy required assistance when he noted that proxy. I can't proxy do these research. It's Snoop Dogg paperwork all over the internet. Snoop Dogg's paperwork right here. Snoop Dogg's paperwork for everyone to see. Everybody to see Snoop Dogg's paperwork, but nobody want to talk about it. Nobody want to talk about. Nobody want to talk about this paperwork. Huh? Nobody want to talk about it? All right. Let, let, let's hear it from Shug real quick. Let's hear it from Shug. Give me one second. Shug. Shug. Interview. Let, 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 let's, let, this is the nigga you signed to. This the nigga you signed to. Hold on. Let me turn this up for y'all. It's movie night. Or I think, um, especially all the artists. This your man, this your man Snoop Dogg manager at the time. But the guys in the inner city. Rap starts with big lawyers. Let me find a few. They well known names, they inform uh, the police, they snitches. They snitches? What? They're going to get a free pass. Why are they going to get a free pass? Uh, there's several artists that would never, ever come to prison. Never? No matter what they do. Are you serious? Cart, if it's firearm, getting the cart with drugs, doing this, doing that. Like who? Well, put it you like this. When you look at it and you think about it, you see that you watch the news, you follow the people's trials, people court cases, or you follow the, what you hear, word of mouth, what you hear about the streets, about the guy getting 25 years because he had. Um, to a piece of crack cocaine. Mr. Snoop Dogg, is that you? The guy got 10 years because he had a firearm. Then you get a guy for us. If it's a uh, little labels, you might get him um, getting caught with drugs. Getting caught with drugs? Um, stab somebody, do those type of crimes, and never come to prison. One of the reasons I never come like Snoop. Snoop, Snoop, hold on, hold on. Play that back. Snoop, Snoop will never come. One hold on, I never come hold on. Snoop. Well, Snoop would never come. I mean, Snoop was on, you know, we'd be the murder trial for him, but then he was on probation. Then he got caught with two ounces of marijuana. Then he got caught with guns. And each time, it's nothing. They're not going to violate him. Because for the street guys, the street guys know what I'm talking about. There's no puzzle. I mean, if you get a guy that has to get in Listen, y'all can't be serious. Y'all can't be serious. And, and I got some, yo, listen, there's so many rap, listen, I'm not even going to get on Young Thug and Gunner. I'm going to just leave that for another day. Let me go check in with this queen real quick. Let me go check in with this queen. Yo, Rachel. Let me go check in with the queen. Let me see if she here. Where the queen at? Where the queen at? She here? Me and the queen about to go live together. Where she at? Where the queen at? I'm looking for the queen. The queen about to join. Me and the queen about to go live together. Where she at? Where the queen at? Yo, make sure y'all tune in. Me and Nicki Minaj about to go live together.
Hold on. Don't don't leave. I'm going to call her right now. I'm going to come back. All right. We probably got to figure it out right now. We just waiting on Figure this out. We we sound like some old heads right now. See see if she on, cause it'll be just easier. Yo Nick, you gotta press request. You should. Hold on. I dad feel like I'm forty years old trying to work a phone. Feel like one of them old heads that be doing the versus battles. Hold on. My shit pause? No. Hold on. We're gonna do this shit. I don't see her. We just got on the phone. Mm -hmm. Matter of fact, look, I'm gonna I'm a call Nikki, I'm gonna tell her and I'm gonna join hers. Everybody go to Nikki Live. Everybody right now go to Nikki Live. Hey y'all, can you hear me? Can you hear me, you guys? You can hear me or no? Oh, y'all can hear me. Okay. So, where's this this troll? Now, he said he's going to send me a request. And he done took up all of the time on live. And y'all already know. So, now I only got like 10 minutes to talk to y'all. So, I did have a couple serious things I wanted to get off my chest. But I guess I'll I'll do that tomorrow Um, at some point. Oh, I see this stupid ass. Yo, what up? Hola. What's the vibe? Damn, why because was... you couldn't see my comment and just click on my thing? You know why I got an Android? That's why I got an Android. Oh, shut up. Okay. Right, yo, yo, listen. Let me let me play. Let me get in my bag real quick because I'm I'm a bob right now. Let me get in my fucking bag. You know no, I'm... we only got ten minutes. We you not doing a bunch of nonsense. I came to do. It. First of all, why are you going crazy? I'm not going. I'm, let me know if I'm spitting. If if I'm saying something wrong, me. Look, let me let, let me just show you and fuck this nigga because after you left this nigga, this nigga's career been gone. Like this nigga. Alright, alright. Let me chill. Let me chill. You right. You right. You right. Let me chill. Let me chill. Let me chill. Let me. You know why? Let me chill because I just exposed mad niggas for being rats. But you know everybody want to be like, no, no, no. I, 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 I didn't. I, I. I can I man, say I'm what I can I say niggas, really, really quickly what I want to say? Because we only got 10 minutes. I, I, I want to say something about this whole rap situation. Go ahead. Um, I feel like this is the music business. And, um, and I think we're confusing the two. So it's like when I talk about people not write, writing rap, that's the, that's the music business issue. Somebody else could be like, oh, I don't care about that if somebody writes their raps. That's their prerogative because they're not in my business. Mm -hmm. they, didn't, they didn't blood, sweat, and tears and grind it out. So they don't, you know, have to feel 
a certain way like I do. My take on it is I feel street niggas have every right to feel how they want to feel about snitching because they live that life. That's a fact. I feel rappers need to play it easy because everybody mingles and, and you know, integrates with everybody. And if a, and if a top executive rap call one of y'all unsigned rappers right now, sign y'all, y'all signing. Yo, so, say it louder. Say it louder. So I didn't hear not, you. We not gonna say that part louder. I ain't hear you. Say that part louder. If a rap a, executive do what? Call y'all a sign. Y'all sign it. So, so let's 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 be clear, be clear when we talk about rappers versus street niggas. It's uh -huh. rappers that put guns they ain't never bust a, a day in their life and their music all the motherfucking time. So we're not talking about rappers. I feel street niggas have a right to feel how they want to motherfucking feel because they in the field. Mm -hmm. And 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 you know, I'm not on the block with six nine. Mm -hmm. Me and six nine is not on the block. We in the music business. So you rappers is in rooms all the time with people with sketchy past. And I'm not judging anybody because that's just I'm not doing that. I have nothing but respect for so many of these people and I would never fix my face to talk crazy about them. My husband doesn't fuck with the snitch culture. My husband is just like, you know, I can't fuck with that. And he ha and I respect him because he, he he's lived a different life. But y'all want to make it rap one minute and streets the next minute. Y'all want to talk about people not writing their raps one minute and then do songs with people that don't write raps the next minute. But if somebody talk about the integrity of hip hop, then it's a problem. But y'all can talk about the integrity of the streets and not snitching. Well, we not on the block. None of you niggas is on the block. If these niggas are still out there doing what they doing and banging and really living that life want to talk about it, I have to respect it. We all got to respect it because they play by a different code. And mm -hmm. everybody can't speak on that. But as far as rappers... Cut it out. Yeah, rappers got to just play it. Cut it out. Easy because y'all know that y'all bend the rules for different, for certain people. Listen, and, Nikki, and, and Nikki, and they pick and choose. Okay anymore. They pick and choose. They pick and choose. You know what? No. I, I can't do that. No. I can't call you right. No, but you know what, him? He never had no friends in the industry. So let's all yeah, you gotta up call on him. Out everybody. If we're going to have that conversation, you got to call out everybody. You can't You can't. Um, be on one person's dick that's living the same kind of life or employing the same kind of person. You got to call out everybody. You got to call out everybody. And, and niggas been ratting, niggas been ratting since the, since the, since the 1800s. So my thing is, but let me just, cause I don't want to, you know, let's be serious. Just, I mean, look, Trolls is about to come out. It's so many special things that I want to share with you guys. I want to, I want to thank, I want to tell my fans, I love you guys so fucking much. Um, I, it's like I said, there's so many things I want to share and I can't share them right at this minute, but just know that I will be sharing so many dope things really soon. Trolls is out right now and, um, we shot it in six nine's house, so we couldn't do much, but we did what we could with what we had, but uh -huh. um, there was some things that I wanted to touch on. Cause I see a lot of people that, you know, they just use certain words, buzzwords to hate on people, but we're not going to touch on it right now because we don't have time. Trolls is out right now. It's out right now? Well, right in 10 minutes. Yo, in 10 minutes, yo, we're going we gonna to shatter it. You know why, Nikki? Me and you the hottest. People don't want to accept that. But me, nobody hotter than us. Okay. Nobody, look, listen, nobody can go live and get that. Go to and get, that. and get the merch. And in terms of, and as far as the, the, the proceeds going to the bailout project, we want to just make sure that um, the protesters and everybody on the, on the front lines of this whole situation that's recently been taking place with Black Lives Matter and all the Black people that have died for nothing, we want you guys to know, well, I personally want y'all to know how much I respect the people out there protesting and, and, and lending their voices for this shit because this is the most important thing that we could be talking about right now, to be honest. And 20% of our proceeds goes to the bailout fund. If you if you are not familiar with the bail bailout fund, it's on my page. The at is on my page, and um, we just want to. So we just want to make sure people have some sort of an outlet. Like God forbid, you find yourself in a crazy situation, you know that there could possibly be a fund to help you. 
Um, we want to obviously say rest in peace to George Floyd and, and send condolences to his family. Rest and in peace, George Floyd. Shout out to everybody, all the black lives that uh, uh, innocent black people that have, that have been killed senselessly. And we hope that um, you guys. It stops. See, we hope that you guys see that your voices are so powerful, so powerful. Went from one cop being charged to four cops being charged. Now we gotta see it through to get these people convicted. But it's just like, I just want y'all to see how powerful y'all are. I love y'all for supporting me, you know, for just riding with me forever. You know, I ain't never gonna be getting up with nowhere uh, apologizing for nothing, Jeff. Yeah, I, yeah that, say it louder, say it louder. Back. So, uh, but but it's all about the fans. The problem is what people be mad at, I notice, is they can't cancel people. Say it one more That's time. That's what really be mad at. They, Say it one more time. Y'all can't cancel people. Why can't the people they? People that y'all cancel, they was already canceled. <laughs> and people y'all cancel, and people that y'all cancel don't, don't chop. People that y'all cancel don't chop top five on the charts with no radio either. So listen, that can't y'all been trying to cancel us for a minute. It's not gonna happen. People because that can't do right now get this. And, and I, I wish that y'all would put your 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 energy into people you love. If you don't love Six Nine and if you don't love Nicki Minaj, we have millions of fans who love us. We are not worried about any of your tweets that hit the 60,000 and 100,000 likes. We good on this side. We, it's about life and abundance. And we are so happy that Trolls is out. And now when y'all hear the verse, it's some funny shit in the verse. Yeah, you, I I, you think I bodied you on the verse or you bodied me? I, I think you bodied me, but let's be real. It's because you rushed me to hands in a verse. And I wasn't finished, and and I be needing time to make my verse right and shit. And that's the tactic that niggas been using lately is try to rush the queen with the motherfucking verse. But you know the queen bounces back in twenty four hours. It's done. It's nothing. When yeah. I get, get done, two sticks in my bun. Pull up in the <laughs> stick, run, make the in the run. Yo, yo, yo! You think they ready for this video that's about to break the internet? And it's twelve a.m. Everybody sleeping. We got everybody okay, up. Okay, bye, y'all. We love you guys so much, and I'll probably come back on live because there's some other real things that I really wanted to touch on. But I love you, and um, I don't have any anger to anybody that this troll has anger towards. Don't try to bring that shit over here. Handle your own shit like men. Like, like men. men. You heard? Now, okay, and I got my list over here. Yo, Nikki, I'm going to holler at you, you heard? Okay, bye. All right, yo, tune in to Trolls.